and there's going to be a lot of noise because uh, the Italians have the favourite in this. We know how quick she is over 50. Benedetto Pilato will go in this one. And again, there might be a little bit of record breaking for different nations here. Myrna McSharry right on the verge of breaking the Irish record. Pilato might have her eyes on the Italian record, and uh, Cara Hanlon set the Scottish record in the semi finals. So, this is quite a fast meet. There's Shelton of the Netherlands will be in lane number one. It's well before the storm here. First of the two Italians, Lisa Angelini in lane number seven. Sophie Hansen goes in two. Katrina Tessa of Koba, first of the two Lithuanians to be introduced in lane number six. The Irish record could go tonight to lane three's Mona Chow. She had a great finish yesterday. She's got a birthday coming up as well next week. 22, she turns on the 21st. And here comes the European record holder. Ruta Meliatite was set in 2013. That when she was really coming into a pomp. She'd won the Olympic title the year before. And here's Benedetta Pilato. Listen to that noise. There's the support team for Benedetta. Oh, I reckon that Italian record might be under threat. Got to find about half a second to break it. Many Tite just faded a bit in the semi. She may well go out and lead this at 50 and see what she can hang on. See how much she's got left of the tank. A big comeback year after. First of all, being, being in the world business, and then seemingly, seemingly having retired, then she popped up on the radar again. And she seems to have uh, found some of that form that took her to that Olympic title in London 2012. So, Santa is where we're looking ready for this one. Pilato, Meliatite, and McSharry. Meliatite will take it out. What's that green cap? In lane number five, she'll swim it like she's in the semi and try and break the field early on now. Going with her though, Bellato roared on by this crowd is not going to allow the Lithuanian to get that advantage at 50 this time though. She's desperately trying to do that. Also going well, Angelini, the two Italians going well early on and they'll be in the top three together. Might be one and three here. Bellato, Meliotiti, Angelini, that's how it looks with uh, 50 to go. Daniel record definitely on the line. The Irish record of McSharry can get going on the line. Bellato in four, Meliotite in five. Angelini, this could be an Italian one too, the way things are looking. If Angelini can come past Meliotite, and she's starting to do just that. Bellato looking strong. Meliotite just finding a second or third win for second place. Also finishing well as Tetris Koba of Lithuania, but it will be Bellato gets the win. One, two for Italy. Angelini in second place and Melia Tite in third. 105.97. Not quite the Italian record, but the only swimmer to go sub 66 is Benedetta Pilato. Ruta Melia Tite in third place and it's a one, two for Italy. Angelini with a terrific burst at the end and that's exactly what this packed crowd in Rome wanted to see. So an Italian one too on the second night and they're singing again here. One oh five ninety seven. Uh, winning time, and it was a terrific finish by Angelini. I thought Meliotite might just have enough in the tank to see off that Italian opposition, but she didn't. And also, Tetra of Koba was finishing very strongly as well, but two Italians getting into the wall first. 16 100s between second and third. Pilato, sub 66.